Nick's obviously out, and which means you and Chase and pretty much everyone else can have a bigger role. How do you kind of view what's going to happen for you now? Um, the way I view it as, you know, Nick Bosa is Nick Bosa. Like, he's, he's always going to be Nick Bosa, but I feel like our motto as a defensive line has always been next man up, you know, and guys just have to step up now, and I feel like the whole entire defensive line is going to step up, and I feel like we're not going to miss a beat. And what about you personally? I feel like I'm going to step my game, take it to another level, uh, keep going as hard as I can every Saturday that comes and keep getting better. I want to ask you about your journey. You come in as a five-star guy, and yet this is an incredibly deep unit. You have to bide your time, be patient. How hard was that for you? Um, it wasn't hard per se. I just knew that every single day I had to bring it. Every single day I had to give it all I had, just keep getting better season by season. And now I have a chance to really go show the world what I can do. And how different are you now this year than in past years? Um, I feel like I'm more focused. I feel like I'm taking on a way bigger role this year, and I can really help my team win. You actually started the first three games. I mean, yes, sir. How much did that mean to you? Hey, it meant a lot. You know, I mean, as a guy from Columbus coming in and starting, you know, three games with the Ohio State Buckeyes, I mean, it's a dream come true. And ever since that first game, like, I've been feeling like, okay, now it's just time to get better. Now it's just time to keep enhancing the type of player I am. How did your parents feel about the 